Welcome for the Imperial Champions and Achievers Toastmasters Club's Humorous Speech and Evaluation Contest being held today at the Paradise Beach Hotel. Today's date is the 4th of October, I believe. And we're running a little late, so we're going to go right into the program. I'd like to acknowledge, first of all, our judges. Our chief judge is two chief judges, Dr. Francesca Onu and Mrs. Barbara Soso, and the other two judges, Cicelyn, Mr. Cicelyn Joseph and Ms. Dawn Small. Also, I'd like to acknowledge our Table Topics Master, Monica Woodley, and our timers, Natalie Mitchell and Janice McMaster, our ballot counters, Marcia Kirby and Dion Harry, our runner, Jody Denny, and our door attendants, Marina Lamkin, Kyle Providence, and Crystal Medford. So a little background to what this is all about. As you know, humorous and evaluation speech contests are held once a year at all Toastmasters, Toastmaster clubs and also in the area. And it is a preparation for the next contest which will be happening in the district very shortly. As a matter of fact, the next contest is on the 17th of October in Barbados. And the winners of these, this contest are going to move on to the humorous speech and evaluation contest in Barbados on the 17th of October. Now, what we have to understand is that the main purpose for such contests are to provide an opportunity for speakers to improve their speaking abilities and to recognize the best as encouragement for all. Also, to provide an opportunity for those who are learning to observe speakers and people who are already prolific in speaking and to learn by watching. The speaking order for today. For the humorous speech contest, we're going to have as the first speaker our champion speaker, Anika Stapleton. Followed, sorry, no, my apologies. The first speaker would be one of our champion speakers also, Gloria Williams. And the second speaker would be Anika Stapleton. And the third speaker would be Nigel Scott. Two speakers are not present at the moment, and I believe that will make them not eligible to contest. That would be, well, we'll leave that there. For the evaluation speech contest, we're going to have the first speaker will be Marlon Stevenson. Second speaker would be Garcia Cato Sutherland. Third speaker would be Ryan Hazel. And the fourth speaker would be Joe Elliott. One speaker is not here, so most likely that person will not be eligible to speak. In terms of eligibility, just for the record and for those of you who don't know, all members have to be in good standing with the club, which means they've paid all their dues. And the dues have been received by the World Health Quarters. Also, I'd like to make you aware that if you're going to be recording or taking pictures, try please not to distract the contestants as flash, you know, if you have to flash lights, that can cause problems and it can distract the contestants. Please turn off all pagers, cell phones, and any object that might make noise during the contest. And also, please remember that no one is allowed in or out of the room while a contestant is speaking. For the humorous speech contest, all speeches must be original. Any quoted material must be identified, and if not so, then uh, there is cause to, 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 to take that further as far as we're concerned. Now, in terms of timing, 